what about me people? So, Javinci, who was once a member of um, the Portmore Empire, led by um, the notorious Vibes Cartel, um, released a song called Charger on the Morning Bliss Rhythm, my people. And honestly, my people, I personally like the song. I like the rhythm, but for the longest time, my people, Javinci has lost um, in, in um, music. He, he w recently was on, um, on stage with Winfred Williams and was talking about... Um, still storing till still doing this thing but people i honestly think um da vinci especially have fallen from grace when it come to um getting the, the publicity that um vice cartel given unto all of the empire members you know what i mean black rhino ain't doing so bad but da vinci we haven't heard anything from him for the longest time according to him his fans still know that um he's doing music you know what I mean? But this song, my people, remind me of when he was in the Gaza and um, doing his thing because it's a nice song. As I said, I like the rhythm and I like the beat. I like the melody of the song. You see me? And the delivery, and he's on point. You see me? I say, but people, I don't know what's going on with him. If he can keep on this piece or this music that he's doing or getting these rhythms still, I think he, he, um, he can really bring back himself in the spotlight because honestly nothing is going on for Da Vinci. You know what I mean my people? And for um him to get a, a forward from the world boss himself, Vice Cartel and um not um being consistent with it is kinda um, mind boggling because Popcorn my people who is a relevant figure in dance hall right now. You see me even when people were saying dance hall was kinda lukewarm because Cartel was not in the scene. Popcorn remain relevant, you know what I mean, and remain um, one of the front run of dancehall. You see me, I say, so big up to Javinci, my people, for really doing this song and really bringing back his name in um, the spotlight. You see me? Peace. I'm out. Work in the country, you have to look pan. And him do great works too, because even though him did a jail, him still be the champion DJ boy, yeah. and some boy will say them didn't want him to go jail. <laughs> the biggest dancehall analyst in the world. Ninja Man, the biggest dancehall analyst in the world, Ninja Man. I am saying that. Winfred Williams, take me on, on that if you wish.